Sometimes when storm conditions are just right, you might be fortunate enough to witness a few spectacular blossoms of anvil crawler lightning, also called spider lightning. Capturing three or four of these remarkable displays in an evening goes down on my books as a great day. Last Saturday night, I witnessed over 200. This video showcases the best 50 lightning discharges from that extraordinary storm in slow motion. Specific conditions made this storm extremely special. The first, what is an anvil and what is an anvil crawler? When a thunderstorm explodes in our troposphere, it can only rise so far before hitting a ceiling. We call this the tropopause. The updraft then spreads outward, like smoke under a table. From a distance, the storm takes on the appearance of an anvil, so we call the spreading flat top of the cumulonimbus an anvil cloud. From above, anvil clouds can flare out covering entire states. Underneath, they are often garnished with mammatus clouds and set the stage for spectacular sunsets. It's here where anvil crawler lightning does what the name implies. Anvil crawlers are not uncommon, however, because they occur at such high altitudes, there's usually low-level clouds and rain hiding them from view. It takes special cloud and rain-free conditions near a powerful thunderstorm to reveal them to you. Slow motion video helps reveal that anvil crawlers are comprised of two main events. First, leaders, typically growing and branching out horizontally, followed by return strokes, the flickering solid line discharges. Some anvil crawlers are conjoined with a cloud to ground lightning strike, and others remain completely intracloud. One particular capture from this evening is extra special. From the top of a small mountain, pointing the camera straight up, I recorded the birth of an anvil crawler. This rare close proximity to the camera slow motion documentation brought to light a phenomenon I've never witnessed in such detail. The increased luminosity of the leader tips, appearing like headlights searching along dark windy highways. storm for a long time and I sure am glad I was able to share it with you guys. Well this chase wraps up a slow month of May in regards to tornado activity but there's still another entire month left in the season and I'll be heading out again soon. Till next time friends! Happy trails!